Welcome back. It is 629. It is the largest tented flower show in the U.S. and Coronado's longest running tradition as this weekend the Coronado Flower Show will return for its 101st year. So joining us now is Jessica Mishovic, a chair of this flower show. Good morning to you, Jessica. Good morning. How are you? I'm well, thank you. So I guess th this begs the question, how did this start over 100 years ago? It really started with the community coming together, wanting to celebrate the spring and joining together and being able to showcase not only our beautiful gardens, but then eventually the things that we could grow. And it's really just sprung from this and it's something we really want to cherish and continue going forward. Just incredible. So. Tell us, it's going to take place this weekend. It's two days. How can people attend and how busy should we expect this to be? Well, we hope it's well attended. Last year we had a great turnout for our 100th. It's Saturday and Sunday. Saturday judging is in the morning. So if you have a flower and you want to enter, please bring it Saturday morning from 7 to 9 a.m. But the show itself will start at 1 o'clock to 5 p.m. on Saturday. And then on Sunday, we're open all day from 10 to 4. And there's really something for everyone. We have a beer garden. We have some amazing vendors that are very on theme and green related. So there'll be some nurseries. There's some great home styling things that you can purchase. And what's really special is that we're going to have great music lineup. So really come stay, linger, hang out. We want you to enjoy yourself. So what are the varieties of, of flowers that are there? What makes them unique? Where do they typically come from? Can you give us the rundown of, of the stars of the show? Oh man, I mean, what flowers, I, it would be hard to exclude. There, there's every single varietal really of, that you'll find here. We have roses. We have something you can grow in your garden. You have people that bring in their herbs. We have succulents, staghorns. Um, there are floral displays, people competing in table designs. We even have kind of our uh, controversial men's section where they kind of make some political plays on whatever is going on with the theme that year. So it's Hollywood and Bloom our theme. So there's a lot of fun things going on with that theme that everyone should come check out. And because the Coronado Floral Association is a nonprofit, I assume that there is a lot uh, in ways of what you can purchase, right? Absolutely. Yes. This is a hundred percent volunteer organization. We have over 200 people come together putting this together. So it's quite an event and we do have lots of vendors coming and not only donating in kind, but also, you know, trying to sell some amazing, you know, aprons or we have, you know, solar, we have some amazing products. I'm not... <laughs> I wish I had the list to give you, but there are so many. They're all online. We'd love for you to come, sip, shop, smell all the roses, and just take your time, hang out. I know, I can just imagine it's probably the best smelling place to be uh, in San Diego this weekend. Absolutely. But in addition to some of the entertainment and food, there will be educational aspects of the show as well, right? Teaching people maybe some floral arrangements, different decorative ideas, which is what I always love to, to show up for. Absolutely. I, the design tent has some of my favorite tents you will see people really it, it becomes kind of the gateway drug into the show because people <laughs> love to do table designs or floral displays so it gets you very involved with understanding scale and balance but you know we have people from the county wildflowers so that's something that's obviously very popular and blooming right now and uh, we have a lot of people from the city coming and doing compost we have emerald keepers on site that are going to have there's going to be a lot of little activities for kids kids 12 and under are free so we always love something free and educational and um, bring everyone okay so kids 12 and under are free ten dollars for everyone else saturday starts at 1 p.m sunday 10 a.m right and then people can go to coronadoflowershow.com for all the other yes. details and uh cool. ways, ways to support thanks yes. so much jessica i hope it's a wonderful weekend Thank you so much. My pleasure. Well, Accessity continues.